I'm going to use AI to make me logos, which should generate me thousands of dollars. So I have zero skill or knowledge in this. This will be interesting. Let's go. So our goal is to make businesses like this on Fiverr. Maybe not this exactly. If I made one Fiverr post, I would have to wait for replies. But if I made a bunch of different type of logos, like this guy's done for writing, this guy's done proofreading, ad copies. If I do minimalistic logos, gaming logos, or animals, I would have so many different gigs going at the same time, I should generate a lot of money. But how does an AI make that many logos? So you want to go to midjourney.com, as you can see, and you're going to want a subscription plan. Yes, you have to pay $10 to earn thousands. So much, right? You can test it for free, I believe, but you obviously don't get the commercial terms, so it's illegal to post them. Now, there's three plans. The basic plan, which is $10 a month, which you get limited generations. $30 a month, where you get 15 hours of fast generations, relaxed generations, and so on. I got the $60 a month because I needed stealth image generation, so no one can take my logos or copy them. So now we have paid for the AI. The next step is making the logos, but we have to test it first because I don't know how to do it. Now, this is where we start the business. We have mid-journey in our Discord deal. DMs. So I'm going to make one type of logo and show you guys the process. Then I'm going to repeat it in loads of different niches like this guy did on Fiverr, as I showed you. Also, stick around to the end because there's a secret trick on Fiverr, which is going to get me way more sales than anyone else. Trust me. Now, I've come up with seven ideas. So like seven kind of niches. Cute mascot logo, which I'm going to show you how I'm going to make it in a second. Fun cartoon logo. Mascot cartoon of you. Uh, minimalistic typography. Hand-drawn logos, which is popular. And retro vintage logos. We're going to go through the process of making a cute mascot logo. I'm going to show you a few prompts you can use yourself. Prompt is what you type in to make the logo. We are now on mid-journey and I thought I'll do a test. Esports mascot logo of an evil pumpkin. Now, I just did a few details. Yellow eyes, cartoon, and text below. Now, even though the text didn't say replays, look at that. If you wanted a pumpkin logo and you saw one of these, would you buy this if it was only $5? I would say yes. And I'm very proud of this. As for my first niche, I want a cute mascot logo. Now, I'm going to definitely use this pumpkin. You can choose which one you want, by the way, like upscale it or if you want different versions of it. So the top two are cool. I think the first one's the best. So if I type version one, it's going to give me four different versions of number one. So I've upscaled the first pumpkin. So as you can see, and I'm definitely going to use this as my first choice. Now, I typed another one saying eSports mascot logo of a cute ice cream smiling. No text once again, and it gave me this. I'm definitely using one of these two. Now, let me go and assign one or two more, and I'll get back to you. So, guys, it's been no time for you, but it's been a time for me. As you can see, I've made three products to stand out on my page first. Now, on Fiverr, you want the best thumbnail as such, like YouTube. So, this is going to be my thumbnail. Three really cute kind of logos, as you can see. We've got an orange juice glass. We've got an ice cream and a pumpkin. Three new things that stand out, especially with the colors. And then I did it again, but I did it for humans this time. So an anime girl, a chef, and a gamer. Now, once I easily made my mascots, like if you're wondering how I did this like as well, I literally typed once again because we're doing a mascot logo. So whatever you want to do, like a mascot, a hand-drawn logo, or whatever, make sure you describe it perfectly to the bot. So esports mascot logo of a cute anime girl character smiling. No text. Give me that. Well, like, gave me these four. Same with a chef. Like, it's not hard at all, and this is so quick and easy. Now we've made base products to show. Now I'm on Fiverr. What I'd recommend is going over to another logo so design. So I've chosen this one here. Great designer, obviously. And I'm going to call it cute mascot logo for you. So they know it's for them. Then choose the category you're going to do it in. Now I'm doing it in logo design and I want to, it's a mascot and it's all, I'm going to tell them what files I'm going to do it in. Now, I recommend doing PSD, PNG, and JPEG, and it's a cartoon drawing too. So I've done the keywords of what it is. So mascot, mascot logo, cute mascot logo, and what it offers. So now I'm going to fill out all the stuff that you don't really want to know, and then I'll show you guys at the end. It's been 10 minutes for me, but for a second for you. As you can see, I've put the pictures on here, as you can see. So when they scroll across my name, they're going to see this, and they're like, whoa, wait, what? And they're going to look through, and they're going to want a design themselves. Now, you want to give a good description. So after using the AI, I mentioned I used AI. Don't forget that. You want to give them a word process as I've done. And also for the packages, like I said, the little secret tip I give is do the cheapest possible. Now, I could only do $15 is the cheapest with free revisions. So they're like, damn, that is cheap for how many revisions of what I get. And for premium, I did it as $25, I believe, which is once again cheap. They get free logos 
free and unlimited revisions. If you saw that, you'd be like, damn, I want something like that because it's cheap. It's amazing. Now you could do mid journey yourself. Yes, but not everyone knows how to use mid journey too and so on. Now they all offer better things and they're all quite cheap too. So I'm very glad the way this turned out. Now I have to make five more and turn a profit on this. But how am I going to make a profit? Well, we're going to get to that. And for like minimalistic typography, I don't know how to do that. Obviously, we're new to this. So I've looked up on some websites and I'll put this in the description. I saw this cool website here. You can use the Mid Journey website, but right now it's down. Uh, you can look, look, and it tells you how to make a few. Now, honestly, you could just copy this. So a logo for an ice cream brand or a logo for a tiger like here in like a famous person's style. Now, I don't recommend copying famous people's styles for commercial use, but I copied that guys in for a minimalistic approach and it gave me this. And it also gave me this. Look at the bottom right one. If you ask me, it's a cool kind of dragon design. Now, I'm excited to make more of these to get loads of gigs out. But once we've done the gigs, we're not done. We've got to find clients. We've got to make the actual products for people and how to make thousands a month from a business like this where you can automate it to spend no time on it. So I'll see you once I've made all the gigs for where we're going to get clients. So let's go. So as you can tell with the lighting in the day, the time has gone past and I've grinded these logos. Now I've only decided to do four because I want to stick to the logo approach for gamers mainly. As gaming is rising, I think it's a great niche. Also, I did a freelancing course to gain some experience. As you can see, already got a message there, but I guarantee you it's going to be a bot. I've received a lot of messages from bots. It is quite funny. And also the prices could be changed down to $5. Now I thought it was 10, as I said earlier on, or 15, but now it's at five. It's so cheap to buy this from me, which is going to get the like the views going up high because people want cheap stuff nowadays. They don't expend a stupid amount and because it's AI, it's going to be a lot quicker too. So there's the one you've already seen. Here's the cool logos you could have made too. So as you can see, it's kind of a ninja style with a replay logo there. You've got M, I'll replay again, and you've got like a balanced scales. The scales are justice. I thought I'd go for a fun cartoon approach, as you can see. Once again, all original from AI and a mascot logo of somebody. So I think these are quite good. Now it's time to turn off Fiverr and check every day for responses. I will see you then. Good morning. It has been a few days. I woke up yesterday to check Fiverr. No responses. I got worried. Real worried. This morning, I turned on my computer and went on Fiverr. Now as a new seller on Fiverr, it's hard to get clients unless you did what I did, as I showed you. Now, if we go on my Fiverr, we have an order. Now, I'm going to blur out the name due to privacy since it's not my place to say, but it's for business use for YouTube, which I thought was really cool, and to build a brand as an artist. So when someone orders, so they said, hi there, I was wondering if you could help me with design for a logo for a Minecraft YouTube channel. The channel name will be Bleep, and I'm aiming for a cute frog type of style that fits within the Minecraft art aesthetic. Let me know if you need more direction on the style. Thanks. Order came in at 3 a.m. and obviously I was asleep. Now we are at 9 a.m. in the morning. This person gave me the standard logo package, so full color, transparent, all file types, commercial use, obviously. Bunch of concepts, free concepts included, but we're going to add a bunch more for the video and a bunch of revisions if you need it. Now, like I said, it didn't take me long to set up mid journey and learn it, plus doing the gigs themselves and doing this logo, which I'll get $10 for, is going to take me at least five to 10 minutes. Now, you're looking to make thousands. Yes, I know, but you need to start somewhere and you need to build your portfolio because on Fiverr as such, you can't go big unless you have a lot of reviews. So you really need to push yourself by getting in there first and get loads of clients. The key words to cover are Minecraft art aesthetic, cute frog type of style, and Minecraft YouTube channel. A slash imagine Minecraft art aesthetic, cute frog style, Minecraft YouTube logo. Now, as you can see, it's generating it, but we're going to use this as a practice. We're not actually going to give the person this one. We're going to change the words about and try find the best ones I like for myself. Now, as you can see, I think the bottom left one looks pretty cool out of all these, so I'm going to save that one just in case. Maybe. I don't know. But I did once you get a client, you're going to want to go through this imagined font and try every different style. So if I type Minecraft art uh, aesthetic again and type cartoon style, cute frog. Now, look, these are all are pretty cool. And they could use the bottom right one out of all of these, I would say, but I don't know. So I'm going to try to generate 50 of these, find the best free. Then I'm going to ask the person if they like it or not, and then obviously keep going over it. This is a great start. Let's see what we can do. So we did the designs and we sent him off to the guy. And I've said, hi. Here are free concepts I came up with. Three different Minecraft aesthetics, which he wanted. Did that with AI, took two seconds. As you can see here, the free concepts I sent out of the hundreds I did took me about 10 minutes.
minutes though whilst I was watching Netflix, so it wasn't an issue. Hi, these are great. Thank you so much for sending them. I really like the middle one with a square head. Without any more concepts, he likes it. So I said, hi, blank. Thanks for the order. Here's your final design. Boom. The person left a five-star review because of how quick I communicate due to AI. The service, good, and obviously, he would recommend. Awesome. It may not be thousands yet, but from getting a software that takes 10 seconds to draw a picture, I have made money. AI is now revolutionary. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you later.